same old dial tones? Me too. Welcome to episode three. Welcome to the start of October. It's time to kick off our next album of the month for dial tones, which is one by Ricky Montgomery. Let's get into a little backstory first. Ricky Montgomery is an alternative indie artist who has been releasing music since 2014. He started making music at age 14 as an escape from everything around him. It was a way to figure out himself and have fun on his own, being especially inspired by artists like Radiohead, Frank Ocean, and MGMT. He gained a small following on Vine before its downfall after making comedic bits with his own music. He now has his own band called The Honey Sticks, but for this month we're going over his solo music off of his Montgomery Ricky album, which came out in 2016 with some notable songs like Mr. Loverman and Line Without a Hook, which you could likely recognize yourself. If you enjoy artists similar to Cave Town, Conan Gray, and Wallows, this may be just for you. Today we will be talking about Cabo, a song off of his 2016 album Montgomery Ricky. The genre is alt-indie like most of his other music. The song has a lot of theories about what the meaning could be, a lot theorizing it's about uh, somebody cheating on him or struggling to find happiness in dark times. We will be going over the theory that it's about a love that's forbidden or hard to pursue. The lyrics talk about our main character as this guy that's reserved and concealing his feelings for this person because it's looked down upon and that he shouldn't be with him. With lines like, do what you can with me, but do it quietly, says that they want to be with this person, but they need to be quiet about it, they have to hide it. Although they are willing to risk being with said person after all, and they want to conceal it so they can be with them no matter what. The chorus talks about how they found a place for them, a place for them to be alone and where they can hold each other and just be lovers and not have to worry about all these outside sources telling them they can't be together. Lines like, wanna see you but I gotta resist is talking about the main character's internal struggles with his own feelings about this person, trying to convince himself that they're bad and they should leave them and that this isn't good. They're seeking validation that their feelings are valid and that they're right for feeling the way they do. Overall, Cabo is about struggling with a love that's forbidden and assumed to be society's eyes, talking about how they still want to be with them and they're willing to find a secret safe place they can be together. They're willing to take the risk of being with them no matter what others say about it because they truly love this person, even if they're bad for them. Well. If you liked today's review, definitely check out Ricky Montgomery's music. He makes a lot of stuff, and even the stuff from his band is really cool. We'll catch you in the next one.